Hi friends, hope you're keeping well. Uh, first things I'd like to say thank you for watching all my videos and today I'll be showing you how to make uh, homemade protein bread. Uh, we eat this bread as part of our breakfast and I hope you'll enjoy. So here's some self-raising flour or you can use any flour of your choice such as plain flour. Uh, we've got seeds, pumpkin seeds, linseeds, raisins, and sesame seeds. And then we've just grinded them into a powder. Now we've got two scoops of protein powder, uh, linseed oil, you can have any other oil, and we have some dried yeast. one teaspoon of salt, one tablespoon of sugar and a cup of warm water. Then you put some sugar into the water and then you mix it. Then you can add your dried yeast and mix it well. To activate the yeast. Then while the yeast is activating you can start pouring the other ingredients into the bread maker. Starting with the three cups of flour and you can put it into the bread maker very carefully. So you can take some time doing this. Once that's done, you can add your protein powder into the bread maker. I'm using the unflavoured protein powder in this case. If you don't have protein powder, you can exclude it. Then I'm adding a teaspoon of salt, the oil, And our yeast hasn't activated yet, so we'll add the powder from the seeds and wait for the yeast to rise. Another suggestion came in from my mother so I'm adding one spoon of basil powder but you can add anything just you like so I'm going to add the basil powder and then the yeast has also activated which we will now add also Then you can close your bread maker and let it work its magic. Set the bread maker to make the bread. So we're going to 3 which is whole white bread and the loaf size we're going to 2 pounds and the colour dark and then we'll press start. The bread maker is now kneading the dough and uh, now to start and the whole process will take 3 hours and 40 minutes. We will jump forward to save some time. Now we're just adding some raisins and as you can see the dough has been kneaded very well and there's 2 hours and 15 minutes left. So there's 1 hour 19 minutes left. You can smell and see some shape of the bread at this stage. The timer is up and here's the beautifully baked bread but it's very hot so we must wait until it cools down before we take it out from its tray. As you can see there is still steam coming from the bread. Uh, it's still very hot so we'll have to wait for it to cool down a bit. 
more. Uh, we'll put it into a, on a ventilated surface so no moisture uh, will build up on the bottom surface. The bread has fully cooled so we'll start cutting it with a big knife. You can see it's quite hard from the outer surface and very soft from the inside. This bread is a much healthier and nicer option compared to the other breads you can buy from elsewhere. I hope you enjoyed the process of making bread with me. Uh, please like and share this video and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.